Hey, hey, welcome back everybody to episode number three of my new Adobe Illustrator CC 2014 series. My name is Steve Looney, and today I'll be going over something that's actually very simple, uh, but a lot of people do not know about. So it's really all about customizing your user interface. Now, the user interface is basically the style of the actual program. Now, as you can see in my thumbnail, and you've probably seen different Illustrator videos on YouTube where certain people have darker backgrounds and certain people have lighter backgrounds. And that's what it's really all about. Um, you're going to notice in my thumbnail that we have a darker background because I like the way that it worked with the thumbnail. But as you can see, I'm working with a lighter area. Okay, if I run my mouse over it, you're going to see. Now, to change this to your liking, you're first going to want to come up to Illustrator, Preferences, User Interface. Okay, and basically what we're going to do is we are going to come up into here and we're going to start with you can see that i have light and my canvas color is white now we can change that light to predetermined medium light medium dark or dark okay this can be done for many reasons just personal preference if you have a really bright screen which i do you might want to do a dark area um, because it might be easier on your eyes um, i personally like to stick with the light and light uh, what you can also do is you can come in here and do specific percentages of it just to get it to your liking and I find that I've actually toyed with this many times but I always go back to the light because it's just what I'm used to I guess um, what you can also do is you can match the user interface right so if we're on light and we do match user interface it's gonna turn it to that interface what do you think is gonna happen if we go all the way dark boom everything's gonna turn dark okay Instead of that white, you see again, match user interface, it's going to do it dark. Now, let's hit OK. This is the reason I personally don't like it. Um, if I'm designing something, and here's my artboard, you can see this artboard is the size of my thumbnail. A lot of times, I'll hide stuff outside of the artboard because I want to be able to kind of see what everything is going to look like finalized, even though when you save it, nothing outside the artwork is going to save. This is what I'm, this is what I mean. You see the shadow that comes over here? I like to kind of throw boxes over these sometimes, things that are going outside the edge, just to kind of, like I said, hide them. Same thing with this stroke down here. Now, when I turn it this color, I can't see that anymore. Um, instead, I see these pop out, which, yes, I can come to my eyedropper and select the background, and they'll hide it again. But to me, it's not really that natural to work on a dark background because when I work on my canvases, I, you know, I have tons of stuff everywhere so we're gonna go back to white for a second I'm gonna hit OK I'm gonna zoom out so you know this is what we're we can design on any of this so I like it to be white because it's just a lot easier the next thing I want to show you is we go back into the user, user interface area uh, there's gonna be two check boxes one is auto collapse iconic panels all right I'm gonna check that and then open documents as tabs all right we're gonna hit OK okay the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the auto collapse. Now, if this is collapsed, actually no, it's, or it's more or less this is collapsed. If you click on something and you're using the color and you change the color and you click off, it's going to collapse. So the other check box is basically if you go to File New and we just hit OK, it's going to open another document up as another tab. And to see this, we're going to hit F on our keyboard, get back to the different preview mode. All right, so you see, look, Tab, Tab. Here's another document we open as tabs. If you do not have that checked, you're not going to get tabs. You're going to get windows everywhere, and you don't want that at all. I mean, it's so nice to be able to switch through tabs like this. I love it. So that's basically it on the user interface. Real quick video. Uh, you know, in this series, we're going to have quick videos, longer videos, but let me know in the comments below uh, what you learned in this video. Uh, and if you already do this, tell me what your preference is. Do you like to go darker with a white background, lighter with a dark, uh, you know, uh, lighter with a light background um, and that's really it everybody please subscribe to my channel because you'll be able to get these as soon as they come out on YouTube and stay tuned for more illustrator videos have a great night everybody peace